Oh, that poor iguana's whole tail fell off. That's a monster, guys. All right, YouTube, what's going on? My name is Gabe Feldman from the Florida Bass TV. And I'm fishing here in South Florida for some peacock bass. But we are not using a traditional bait today, guys. We are using a mini, tiny, smallest shark bait I could find. A little Rebel Pond Minnow is what I'm using right now. That side. This side's not as good. Oh, I, I should have gone after this Buick. <laughs> There's a lot of peacocks in here too. But before we do that, let me show you. But before we get to fishing, let me show you what I'm using. Um, this is the Casting Kodiak. It's ultralight version of the Assassin. Some foot. Throw a 12 pound four harmony leader with this tiny little jerk bait. You guys might think it's so stupid to throw this little jerk bait, but if you've seen in the last video, this bait absolutely destroys, dude. I'll remember you. Don't worry. That's a monster, guys. Holy crap. Hit it right on the side there. Oh, that's my PB. That's my PB peacock, guys. Yes, that is a monster. Oh, it's so big. Oh my God. Okay, I'm gonna pull him back over here. Back over to where I can pull you up. Oh, holy crap, guys. This is a monster. Never caught one this big. Oh. oh, yes. That's my biggest ever peacock. Didn't bring the freaking scale with me today. I brought some pliers though, I know I need those. Look at that fish, guys, that's crazy. On the tiny little jerk bait, right on the edge there. Look at that peacock, guys. It's got to be like a four pounder. And this thing is just freaking solid. Such a thick fish. It's got some leeches in his mouth. There you have it. Guys. Uh, that's my biggest peacock ever. Whew, he's ripping up my thumb. Look at that thing. Whoo! The toad, that was like a four pound peacock. Look at those colors. Such a pretty fish. All right. But yeah, guys, those jerk baits. Uh, definitely a good bait to fish in the winter time the bites kind of hard oh, the water is really cold you can tell it's a lot different even on the warmer days here in the winter time the water still hasn't warmed back up like it is in the summer so these fish are kind of weird 
Honestly, this little three dollar jerk bait from Walmart will tear up some peacocks. You don't need a fancy fifteen dollar suspending Lucky Craft jerk bait. This thing will tear them up. It sucks about this bait. The hooks bend out, so if you have a big fish like that. You don't really know if he's going to stay on. That's why I keep my drag a lot looser when you're fishing with a small jerkbait like this. If you're really going to try the micro fishing like this, um, you can catch a lot more fish and get a lot more bites at least. But landing them is kind of hard. I've lost a lot of fish with this thing because hooks will bend out. I think that might be a knife fish, guys. The way it feels is different. Oh, it's peacock. It's peacock. Oh. Popped off. Oh, I bent out two of my hooks. Can set that drag a little bit looser, guys. Dang. Cichlid. Stop. Little mine cichlid. Oh, that poor iguana's whole tail fell off. You good, buddy? I guess he's fine. And we catch some fish on it. Anyways, the rod I'm using, it's the Cast King Assassin, it's the 7 foot, and this thing's awesome, it's like my medium light combo, and it's the Kodiak with, uh, I think it's a 2000 on here, and that's what I'm using for the reel, so check all that stuff out in the description below guys, I got everything on there, um, if you guys want, you can just press the links there, and it'll take you right to the links on Amazon, and you can get all the gear, and braid I'm using too is from Cast King as well. You want to check that out it's my favorite bread on the market anyways guys hope you enjoyed the video and make sure to check out the casking channel as well and um, stay tuned until next time